Alright, in this video, I'm just going to show you guys me playing GPSP, unofficial GPSP. Unofficial works better for me, so I just use it. I'm going to put it in the video description, I'm going to have the download there, and the, all the Pokemon games like Emerald, Ruby, Leaf Green, Fire Red, and Sapphire. Alright, first I'm going to load up GPSP. And the one thing I like about this, having a emulator, is because you can load states like what you did last. First, I'm going to load up Pokemon Emerald. And this is one thing I really like about this. Okay, you just press triangle. You have this nice little menu. You go to the load state up from slot zero. Press circle, because that's the A button for this. Then I'll say oh, you can't see that. Load state number zero and then just click circle yes. And it'll load from exactly where you were. And you have to do what you just did. So I would have to do this. And even if you're talking to someone you can press triangle and save state zero. And I'll save it. And you have up to Ten states, so you can save ten different things, like ten different gym battles or whatever, on one ROM. On another ROM, you have ten different states. Okay, now I'm going to load Fire Red. Okay, I haven't really played this game because I just got all the ROMs, so I just got my PSP to start working. So. Let me just check, I don't have anything in my load state. Nope. Nothing. Let's press X. I'm gonna start off like very red wood. Make sure it's PSP, so. It's pretty cool, I think. Price triangle. Load new game. And I'll also include the BIOS that you need to play all these games. Like, you need BIOS in the folder. I'll have everything there, so all you have to do is add the ROMs. And there's cheat files. In another video, I'll show you how to put cheat files on, like, Pokemon games. And I think that's pretty cool. Like, Rare Candies, which I didn't really use, but... Now this is Leaf Green. And even during a battle, you can save it, which I think that's awesomely cool. You just press triangle, save state, zero, and I'll save right there. Okay, now we're going on to Pokemon Ruby. Okay, I'll just press triangle and load the state. And I think that's a lot easier than saving. Wild Wurmple, you can battle, looks pretty decent too, like this is full screen for me and I don't think it's too too bad. Man that Wurmple is powerful. The one emulator I wish it would come out with quick, the one that works is a Nintendo DS one. I think that would be really cool. But it probably won't happen. They have one, but it only plays homebrews. So you can play like Diamond. Okay, now Pokemon Sapphire. Press Triangle. I think I have Load State, but I'm not positive. No, I do not. So I just go to the game. Let's watch the intro.
The one thing I hate that you cannot do is you cannot trade. That's the one thing you cannot do. But you can cheat to get the Pokemon you want, though. That's one thing I will say. And I'll include all of the games I played today in the video description. And there you go. How to play Pokemon games using GPSP unofficial. Well, you can use official. I'll try that one and test it. Thanks for watching.